successfully. I kind of want to know what this looked like in it. <laughs> I can tell they did a very accurate recreation. <laughs> Walk the pirate. I don't think it's wise to wake a sleeping pirate. Hoy there, stranger. Mew in town. <laughs> My guy was I'm new in town. <laughs> He's just a. Who's in charge? Who's in charge here? Well, this island has a governor, but we pirates have our own leaders. Script creation utility for Manic Mansion. Really? I want to talk to the leaders of the pirates. You should go talk to the important looking pirates in the next room. They're pretty much in charge around here. They can tell you where to go and what to do. Nice talking to you. Nice talking to you. Have fun on Melee Island. <laughs> I don't want to bother them. They're busy listening to the guy on the left. What are you looking at me Whoa. for? I'd like to introduce myself. My name's Guybrush. Oh, Guybrush. Yeah? So what? I'm looking for the Excuse dartboard. Excuse me, but I'm looking for the dartboard. Dartboard? We don't have one anymore. There was a horrible accident. <laughs> Drinking and darts don't mix. Where can I get a drink? A drink? You could wait for the cook to notice you. But that would take all day. Wait for the Just cook find to the notice you. Sneak into the kitchen. That is what we all do. What happened to your eye? <laughs> well, I was putting in my contact lens when... Hey, wait a this second. contact lens? That is none of your business. <laughs> I've had those issues with contact lenses. Sorry to bother you. Bye. Right. Right. I think they're busy. I think they're busy. Hi. Cobb. <laughs> I yourself. I. <laughs> Ask me about Loom. <laughs> tell me about so, Loom. Tell me about Loom. You mean the latest masterpiece of fantasy storytelling from Lucasfilm's Brian Moriarty? Why, it's an extraordinary adventure <laughs> with an interface of magic. <laughs> Stunning, high-resolution 3D <laughs> landscapes, sophisticated score and musical effects, not to mention the detailed animation and special effects, elegant point-and-click control of characters, objects and magic spells. <laughs> Beat the rush! Go out and buy Loom today! Nice hat. Hi. <laughs> Oi. Nice talking to you. Loom is a real game. Oi. <laughs> Oi. <Oy. laughs> it all says his eye until you ask him about Loom. Spiffy. Arf. <laughs> Melee Island. <laughs> Chuck. Oh, yes, it's Michael Chuck. It's okay. I don't see anything special about it. Ah, uh, this must be the pirate cap lords or whatever. 
<laughs> Important looking pirates. I want to be a fireman. I want to be a pirate. So what? Why bother us? Hey, don't forget we're short on help because of this whole chuck thing. So, so no pirates means no swag, and no swag means no grog, and we're getting dangerously low on grog. <laughs> Gotta keep the grog supply up. <clears throat> Do you have any <clears throat> special skills? I can hold my breath for ten minutes. I mean, that's pretty impressive. Uh, all right, but you don't become a pirate just by asking. Go up real. You have to go through the three trials. Uh, what three trials are those? There are three trials every pirate must pass. You must master the sword and the art of thievery and the quest. The quest. Oh, shit, the quest. Treasure hunting, you sea urchin. Right! You must prove yourself in each of these three areas. Swordplay, thievery, and a, a treasure huntery. Treasure huntery. And return with proof that you've done it. Uh. And then you must drink grog with us. Grog! Be a pirate sounds pretty awesome. Tell me more. more about mastering the sword. First, get here your sword. You must seek out and defeat the sword master. Someone in town can probably direct you. Oh! Oh! You want to find somebody to train you first. <laughs> Imagine trying to take on a sword master without any training. <laughs> 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 Tell me more about mastering the art of thievery. We want you to procure a small item for us. The idol of many hands. In the governor's mansion. The governor keeps the idol of many hands in a display case in the mansion outside the town. Hmm. You'll have to get past the guards, naturally. The tricky part will be getting past the dogs outside. Hey, they're particularly vicious. They might be able to drug him or something. Drug. <laughs> Guess that's not a bad idea. Tell me more about treasure hunting. I mean, we're already the halfway there. I can go get some grog out of my fridge. Here on the island, all you must do is find the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island and bring it back. <laughs> Should I have a map or something? Well. Can hardly expect to find a treasure without a map. And don't forget, X marks the spot. <laughs> What's in that grog stuff anyway? Grog is a secret mixture which contains one or more of the following: kerosene, kerosene glycol, artificial sweeteners, <laughs> sulfuric acid. Rum, acetone, red dye number two, <laughs> scum, <laughs> axle grease, X. battery acid, and or pepperoni. <laughs> As you can probably imagine, it's one of the most caustic, volatile substances known to man. <sighs> the stuff eats right through these mugs, and the cook is losing a fortune replacing them. <laughs> I'll just be running along now. Leave us to our grog. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. Hey, you can't come back here. <laughs> I can't come back there. Oh, no, resume. Deep beneath Monkey Island, the ghost pirate LeChuck ship lies anchored in a river of lava. All right. Huh. Captain LeChuck, sir, I, 
Ah, there's nothing like the hot winds of hell blowing in your face. No, sir. You can try any and all options you want. You can't die in this game with one exception. It only sets you back to puzzles that have killed you. Okay, cool. Good to know. Yo, what a brain. It's days like this. Actually, achievement since it's so hard to do. <laughs> Oh, yes, sir. <clears throat> glad to be dead. <laughs> you are glad to be dead, right? Oh, yes, sir. I, I feel so lucky that you happened to capture my ship and murdered me and everyone on board. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes, sir. Lucky. Glad to hear it. Now, what was it you disturbed me for? Uh, y yes, sir. Well, you see, we might have a problem on Melee Island. Problem? What possible problem could there be? I've got those sissy pirates so scared of the sea, they're afraid to take a bath. Well, there seems to be a new pirate in town. Actually, he's a pirate wannabe. Young, inexperienced, probably nothing to worry about. Don't know why I bother you with it. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have him taken care of myself. Wait! I'll handle this personally. My plans are too important to be messed up by amateurs. Yes, sir. Who's this guy? Excuse me, but do you have a cousin named Sven? What? <laughs> Never mind. Good night. Excuse me, but do... Now oh, it's only you again. I just want a map. Shh. Pipe down, will you? That ugly sheriff might be around here. Now then, let's talk business. <laughs> well, Want to buy a map to the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island? Only one in existence. Rare. <laughs> Very rare. Only 100 pieces of eight. Uh, no thanks. I don't have enough money. Well then, buzz off, kid. It's bad for business. Hmm. 100 pieces of eight, eh? Whoa. Looks comfortable in a spooky sort of way. No thanks. I'd rather not touch any of this creepy voodoo stuff. Hmm. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. What possible use could that have? Uh, I think I hear slithering inside. Gee, I wonder what's in these baskets. Poor chickens. What <laughs> may I help you with, son? It's the old voodoo lady. I am a mighty pirate. Wait. Don't say anything. <laughs> I can sense your name is... is... Guybrush. Guybrush nose hair. <laughs> three food. <laughs> Guy Damn, she's brush, good. Three food. Am I not right? Wow, that was amazing! Do you know any other tricks? I do not deal in tricks. What I know is the truth. So, my mind reading skills tell me it is your future you are interested in. Are you certain this is something you really wish to know? Yeah, sure. Yes, tell me yes, everything. Tell me everything that's going to happen to me. I am getting a vision. Whoa. I see you taking a voyage. A long voyage. A voyage. I see you captaining a ship. Ooh. Yeah. 
I see. What? See what? I see a giant monkey. Yikes. <laughs> I see you inside the giant monkey. Oh, that's not good. Gross. Wait. It's all becoming clear. Your journey will have many parts. You will see things better left unseen. You will hear things better left unheard. You will learn things better left unlearned. What kind of things? I hate surprises. No. no. The time is not right to know. When you know your purpose, come see me. I will let you know then. Whoa. Yikes. <laughs> the hell? Where's the Scooby Doo bullshit? <laughs> yeah, keyboard action to actually pick things up, push pull things. Oh, oh yeah, I saw those commands on the retro. <clears throat> Give, pick up, use, look at, push, talk to, pull. <laughs> hey, nice rats. Do you like rats? I love rats. Yes, I love rats. They're very intelligent creatures. <laughs> <laughs> More intelligent than him. Why, there's a story around these parts that a bunch of rats actually crewed a ship here from Fable the Monkey Island. No, that's not right. It was actually a group of monkeys. That's amazing. But true. When they arrived, they sold the ship for a pretty penny. Only time I've seen anyone get the better of old Stan in a deal. <laughs> I thought it was rats. Say, are you guys pirates? No, we're a wandering circus troop. <laughs> but this rat scared away the elephant. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> of course we're pirates. You can't buy clothes like these off the rack. What do you want? What's in the keg? Rum. Jam. Jam. Uh, rum. <laughs> uh, rum and jam. It's an old pirate favorite. Everybody knows that. <laughs> rum jam. Do you guys know the sneaky looking man on the opposite corner? Wanna buy a map, eh? Our maps are top quality. Not like the bird-caged liners you get from that clown across the street. <laughs> no, just kidding. <laughs> These are actually copies of the mini- Oops. It's the last meeting of the Melee Island PTA. <laughs> Can't even give them away. <laughs> <laughs> what one? Well, I'll take one if you give me two pieces. I'll take one if you give me two pieces. No, of eight. but I'll take one if you give me two pieces of eight. Okay, that's fair. <laughs> I'm really interested in this pirating thing. What do you want? How come you're on this street corner and not on a ship, looting, pillaging, sacking, that sort of thing? Well. Pirating hasn't been panning out so well for us. There are some unnaturally talented pirates in the area right now. Operating out of Monkey Island. So we've been pursuing alternate means of self-support. 
We're trying to start up a circus. It was working out well until the rats scared off the elephant. So where's the elephant now? Now you've depressed us. <laughs> Go home. Oh. I'm sorry. So, hold on. Maybe we should go through this. Press the V or control key to bring up the verb menu. Use the mouse select which verb you want to activate. Such a verb. The cursor will change. Show the verb you have picked over the object or person you wish to interact with. Use a default action with an object. This will be shown. Okay. Pull up the inventory method with I or Alt. Highlight different items for your inventory. If you wish to use or combine items in your inventory, first select the verb with the verb menu, and then pull up the inventory menu. Use the cursor to highlight the item you wish to activate, and left click on the mouse to complete the action. Some items will allow you to use them with another item, either on the environment or your inventory menu. Use pot with meat. If you're ever unsure what to do next, look like bring up hints by pressing H. You will start off being slight clues. It will require further help. You can continue to press H for more and more detailed descriptions. Oh, that's pretty cool. Huh. I'll be right back. BRB. And we're back. Uh -uh. It doesn't seem to open. There sure are a lot of spelling errors. Ooh. There's the old man's mansion. All right, that's that. Hello, rats. It's locked. You gotta get me out of here. I'm a victim of society. <laughs> Not to mention halitosis. Yeah. <laughs> hey, it's hard to keep my breath minty fresh when there's nothing to eat in here but rats. Yeah. Hey, you come over here.
Hello? <laughs> Anybody in the here? circus. <laughs> I guess that's there. Hello? You know, bad things could happen to a person in a dark, deserted alley like this one. And at this time of night, nobody would be around to see it. Did you hear something back in here, too? No. I'd better get your name. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, and I'm new in town. Listen, Peepwood. <laughs> Threepwood. Guybrush Threepwood. <laughs> Whatever your name is, listen. What a name. I'm the sheriff around here. Sheriff Fester Shinetop. Take it from me. This is a bad time to be visiting Melee Island. A very bad time. My advice to you is to find somewhere else to take your vacation. Somewhere safer. Boy, I feel much better knowing there's an officer of the law around. A circus! I love a circus! Yo, Nick Curry! That come back with a 14 month resub! Nick Curry, you are now the mightiest barbarian. And it's true, I've never played the old version. I do enjoy <coughs> switching back to it, it's pretty cool. I'd say they recreated it pretty darn well. But uh, I have a friend who'd always tried to get me to play these games, and I just never found the time to. So I'm really excited to get to these. How are you doing today, Nick Curry? Ahoy there, fancy pants. What do you want? <laughs> I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. The Swordmaster of Melee Island? Hmm. Now, I don't know. See, nobody knows the whereabouts of her secret hideout. Her secret nobody hideout, eh? Except me. I'd have to go and ask her if it's okay to show you the way. Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. Once. Be right back. <laughs> Anything. Of course not. Slashmaster, when you want a sword as sharp as your wit. Ring bell for service. It never fails. I step away from the counter. <laughs> Two seconds and some idiot's already ringing that stupid bell. <laughs> The Swordmaster says you can jump in the lake, by the way. What do you want? Jump in the lake. I could really use a breath mint. Whew, you're telling me. Here, take one. Please, take the whole roll. <laughs> That'll be one piece of eight. What else do you want? About this sword. Yeah, what about it? I want it. That's a hundred pieces of eight. Take it or leave it. I don't have enough money. Figures. Now how else do you want to waste my time? <laughs> Lots of ways. I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Maybe if you asked her again? Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there. Again. <laughs> Taking that sword. And don't touch anything! No, no, of course not.
a hill. Take the shovel. You little thief. Oh, no, no. I, I didn't do nothing. I... Maybe you'd like to pay for those. No, I, I wouldn't actually. About this shovel. Yeah, what about it? How much is it? Oh, another would be treasure hunter, eh? That'll cost you 75 pieces of eight. Yeah. I don't want it. Then you better go put it back. Well, I guess we have to act. What kind of a pirate are we? We can't just take what we want. <laughs> Pathetic excuse for a pirate. Isn't thievery Is one of the parts? Maybe you can afford. About this sword. Yeah, what about it? No, I don't want it. <laughs> Figures. Now, how else do you want to waste my time? I think I'd just like to browse. Whatever. Let's go back in the alley. I feel like there's probably more in here. Employees only. Well, we got the breath mint now. We will take it to the guy in the jail. <clears throat> Talk to Death Breath? No thanks. That doesn't seem to work. Oh, Grago Mint. How refreshing. Thanks. So, have you come to release me? Who are you? My name is Ores. At least I think it is. I've been in here so long I can hardly remember. You gotta get me out of here before I lose my mind completely! Can't you see? I'm innocent! But why are you in jail if you're innocent? Mm -hmm. Good question. <clears throat> I was framed! I By didn't the rat. touch the stupid flowers! What flowers? The jello conish in dormi flowers in the forest. It's against the law to pick them. Sheriff Shinetop sure is a jerk, isn't he? No kidding. Fester Shinetop is the meanest man on Melee Island. Luckily, the governor keeps him in check most of the time. We used to have a fair, decent man for a sheriff, but he recently died under mysterious circumstances. If you ask me, I think uh -oh. the new sheriff had something to do with it. I think you've said enough, Otis. Whoops. I hope you haven't been taking this filthy vagrant too seriously. <laughs> He'd say anything to avoid paying his debt to society. You know what, I'll pull up Diablo. <laughs> it's hey, filthy, he filthy. Smells bad too. he smells bad too. Hey, thanks a lot. <laughs> You've got a lot of nerve coming into this town and passing judgment on the locals. If there's something you don't like about the way we smell, you're welcome to leave anytime. Sorry. Look, I don't know what you're up to. 
But whatever it is, it's probably illegal. So forget it. It's probably illegal. Wherever you go, is it? Day, awesome. I'll be watching. And if you try any monkey business, you'll end up in here for good. Man, is he a pill or what? You see what I have to put up with? <laughs> you better go before you get his body in trouble. Come to interrogate the prisoner again, huh? Can I get you anything? Yes? You can get me out of here! <laughs> Actually, something to get rid of these rats would be nice. I'll trade you this carrot cake my Aunt Tilly made. I hate carrot cake. <laughs> so, uh, how's the my carrot cake? Oh, you know, the usual. Slaw, grog, gruel, rats, box, and body lice if I can catch them. I have a carrot cake my Aunt Tilly made, even though she knows I detest carrot cake. Actually, the cook at the bar is an old friend of mine, and sometimes he sneaks me food, like pork trimmings, mostly feet and lips. But once in a while, he brings this really odd rump roast. <laughs> odd rump roast. What was so odd about the rump roast? Well, it's the only rump roast I ever seen with a prehensile tail. Oh. So who'd want to frame you? I don't know who exactly. I think it was a conspiracy. And if there's one type of piracy I don't like, it's conspiracy. Look, I like visitors and everything, but I don't have much more to say. Plus, my throat's getting dry from all this talking. Why don't you go find someone else to talk to? It's not like I'm the only pirate left on the island or anything. It's locked. I guess we could try going to the governor's mansion. Try our hands at thievery. I want to try to go talk to the cook. I said, don't pester the rat. <laughs> Is it only a menu effect, or can you actually play it in the original graphics? I think you can actually play it. You actually have all the options. We can play it like this if we wanted to. Which is pretty cool. There's really anything else. Oops. I keep clicking off of the of the screen. Let's go talk to the chef. Hey! You can't come back here! Oh, I like the update. Oh, I never played the old one, but I think they did a really good job of recreating each scene. Cozy. Cozy. Yo, what a blabber. I don't see anything special about it. We walk back this way, maybe? Nah, doesn't seem so. That's okay. Well, so let's, uh, let's try heading to the governor's mansion, see if we can steal that uh, multi-hand statue or whatever it was. Have I played many adventure games yet? No, not really. Certainly not a point and click adventure like this. I don't see anything special about it. <laughs> the deadly piranha poodles.
I don't think I can get past them. I don't think I can get past them. I'm not going near them. <laughs> Deadly piranha fools. Hmm. Nothing that way. Let's go back into the alley. Maybe there's something back there, but I just... I don't know. I kept hearing psst back here, but I don't know. Oops. Damn it. Damn it! Employees only. Employees only. Ouch. I feel like utter dicks. We're an hour to Rosedale, an hour back for a two hour meeting to be lectured on a topic I've already been recognized by my ability to execute properly. Ugh. Oh, God, that sucks. Sorry, Lammer. That is unfortunate. Feed the pro ah, okay. I like the little hint thing. That's pretty nice. All right, so we just need some food to distract the piranha poodles. Damn it! This just happens when you don't play in full screen mode. I guess we could go borrow the bone from that other dog if he lets us. to see you again. Where can I find the governor? Governor Marley. I guess we didn't do all the dialogue options for him. Side of town. But pirates aren't as welcome around her place as they used to be. Why not? Well, the last time she had a pirate over for dinner, he fell in love with her. It's made things See, rather for first, uncomfortable. Then again, many point to the to trailer to trailer because the players figure out what the game wants, yeah. Yeah, I, was, I like that they're pretty subtle. They just kind of hint at the general direction, but I pressed it second time because it didn't stay up that long. And each time you press it, it gives you a little bit better and better of a hint. So that I like that it kind of tailors the hints and it kind of gives you a little hint, then a slightly better hint, and then a, a big hint eventually, I guess. Who's this pirate? It was none other than the fearsome pirate, the Chuck. Well, there's a whole big story. And I don't feel like wandering around for an hour just what trying to click mean? everything, so I'll probably use the hints from time to time. Esteban over there at the other table might tell you about it. He takes the whole thing seriously. Very seriously. My name's Guybrush Threepwood. I'm new in town. Guybrush Threepwood? <laughs> That's the stupidest name I've ever heard. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of like Guybrush. But it's not even a name. Oh, you can? That's... Well, yeah, that's where we came from initially. Well, what's your name? My name is Mancom Seepgood. <laughs> uh oh, looks like my grog is going flat. Mancom so Seepgood. Nice talking to you. Have fun on me. That'll probably be holding you back on quite a few puzzles. All right, fair enough. I 
don't think it's wise to wake a sleeping pirate. What now? Can you tell me the story about this LeChuck guy? LeChuck? He is the guy that went to the governor's for dinner and never wanted to leave. He fell for her in a big way, but she told him to drop dead. So he did, and then things really got ugly. What's so scary about this LeChuck guy? LeChuck was a fearsome pirate. He tried to impress the governor by sailing off to find the secret of Monkey Island. But a mysterious storm came up and sank his ship, leaving no survivors. We thought that that was the end of the fearsome pirate, LeChuck. We were wrong. We were wrong. What happened then? He still sails the waters between here and Monkey Island. His ghost ship is an unholy terror upon the sea. That is why we are all in I have heard this game is hilarious. Look, uh, so I've definitely been looking forward to playing it. Shake it up. So, uh, if you don't mind. No thanks. I can't stand salesmen. This is the boy who wants to be a pirate. How do you fare on your quests? You're a bunch of foul smelling grog swilling pigs. To be a pirate, you must also be a foul smelling grog swilling <laughs> pig. <laughs> I'll just be running along now. Leave us to our grog. Come back later and tell us how you're doing! So my arm across the jar, that's OG meme. Damn it! I'm telling we're doing that a lot. I can't pick that up. Let's try doing what Psycho Sheep said and go out of town. I see how the Chuck could fall for her so quickly. Somebody's calling me. Stupid salesman. That's cool, so we can go to the rest of the island. Oh, it's a circus. I get in the cannon, but the gunpowder makes me sneeze. Well, I can't do it. I hurt my hand taming the lions last week. I hardly think that little scratch compares to my chronic allergy. You get in the cannon. You don't have any allergies, you faker. You get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. No, you get in the cannon. Slacker. Loser. <laughs> Raffian. Flop. <laughs> Fuck. <Whistle. laughs> Weasel. Miscreant. Toady. Nerdwell. Scuffler. Mullet head, <laughs> millet head, pencil head, half head, cheese head, <laughs> poppy. What? What? Just to get in the cannon. 
No, you get in the cannon. Does this place say their son? Oh. How would you like the chance? A once in a lifetime a chance to perform an amazing feat. A death-defying feat? Well, not so death-defying, really. Uh, dangerous feat? No, not dangerous at all. An easy feat. But exciting. With the amazing. Adventurous. Acrobatic. And exceedingly well-known. Fabulous. Flying. Ferrucini brothers. That's us. My brother Alfredo. And my brother Bill. Bill? You sound good. Oh, Bill Ferrucini? <laughs> See that cannon over there? All you have to do is a get in the cannon and we'll shoot you out of it. Across the room. Quite safe, actually. So, what do you say? How much will you pay me? How about 478 oh. pieces of eight? That's a lot of pieces of eight. Okay, sounds good. Have you got a helmet? Damn. Uh, no, I don't have a helmet. Will I need one? No helmet? Oh, you've got to have a helmet. Can't do the cannon trick without a helmet. No, Siri. Go get a helmet and then we can do the trick. Weasel. Weevil. <laughs> Miscreant. Tony! Ned I'm selling these fine jackets. Scuffler! Mallet head! Can I borrow a trampoline? Mallet head! Pencil head! Why are you guys dressed? Hello again! <laughs> Ready to do the cannon trick? Have you got a helmet? Of course I have a helmet. Of course I have a helmet. What sort of idiot do you take me for? <laughs> well, let's have it. We want to be sure that it's a safe. Wouldn't want you hurt. No, sorry. Eh, yeah, we'll just leave. <laughs> yes. What's anything special about it? All right, so we got the circus tent. I don't see anything special about it. I don't see anything special about it. Let's see what's going on over here. <laughs> Whoa. It's a troll. Stop! <laughs> you must pay a toll. <laughs> pay the troll toll? Stand aside, troll. Stand I'm a aside, mighty pirate. Troll. I'm a mighty pirate. <laughs> You're no pirate. Well, the town drunk could out insult you on his back. And probably would. Oh, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, you could stand a lesson or two if that's the best you can come up with. You can't pass until you pay the toll. Look <laughs> behind you, a mouse. I'm not falling for that. <laughs> Scuttle along, you scurvy sea slug. I'm gonna guys tell you what the rules are. You have to try and play the game. None By those rules, eventually, guys, off of the way forward is try and figure out how to None break the rules without pass. getting caught. <laughs> None shall pass. You can't pass until you pay the toll. I like the little Monty Python reference. How much is the toll? Well, what have you got? A piece of eight? I want something that'll attract attention, but have no real importance. Construction paper jockey shirt. <laughs> Credence. <laughs> a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle? A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. Don't be silly. <laughs> Chances to give me what I want, then I eat ya. Hmm. All right. Well, I don't see anything special about it. None shall. I don't see anything special about it. That's like 
can't pass. All right. Uh, None shall pass. None shall pass. That's pretty useless, but it's not what I want. None shall pass. Ooh, that's refreshing. None shall pass. None shall pass. That's pretty useless, but it's not what I want. Can I get him to eat me? None shall pass. You dare offend me with such a paltry amount. <laughs> Damn it. Well, we'll try to go on to that island. Oh, well, dirty rotten pirate. Let's see if we intercept him. Get him! Hook Island. Restrooms and souvenirs. Hmm. I think it could support my weight. It's just like the one on the other side. It's just like the one on the other side. Hmm. I think it could support my weight. I can't move it. Okay, just tightrope walk across, I guess. Hmm. Lookout point. Hmm. So we can't get past here without getting past the troll toll. Alright, so we need something a little more in town. That's fine. You should find a helmet. I'm not sure. Oh, really? That's good to know. Find a helmet. A helmet. Maybe like a bucket or something. touch any of this creepy voodoo stuff. No thanks. Something will probably jump out and bite me. Maybe no one will miss just this one thing. Poor little thing. Whatever it was. Probably got a body in it. With a bully in the middle. Hopefully that's what he wants. Guess I'll just be going now. <laughs> I remembered that from earlier, but I didn't think to pick it up. Alright, so let's... Let's, uh, let's hope that that's what the troll wants. Can't imagine what else we would do with it.
That's pretty useless, but it's not what I want. I want something that will divert attention from things that are really important. Hmm. None shall pass. Oh, the pulley. Oh, we can use that at the... Uh, None shall pass. I guess we could go across the rope bridge with it. I'm trying to double click doesn't seem to want to go. That's okay. There we go. <laughs> hey. Visitors, who are you? I'm Bob the Dare. Are you my Hi, mother? Right are you my mother? <laughs> no, your mother was a duck. Now beat it. <laughs> I'm a pirate cannonball head. Who are you? My name's Meat Hook, and I think you've got a little attitude problem. Well, I think you've got a little hair problem. Jeez, you just don't know when to quit, do you? Obviously, neither did your barber. Obviously, neither did your barber. Ah! Why, you... I suppose you've come to invade my peaceful home and insult me again, eh? Excuse me, but the sign said there were restrooms in here? Sorry, but that sign's a little out of date. I used to have a thriving tourist business here. I had animal wax, tattoo demonstrations, souvenirs. Tattoo there was demonstrations? A accident with one of the trained animals. One of our guests was hurt very badly. So I was shut down, put out of business, and since then, I've lived here all alone. And the only company I have is the same beast that mauled that unlucky tourist. The same beast that made me a hermit. A monster that, just by coincidence, is identical to one what attacked me when I was just a child. And left me with these hooks instead of hands. A deformed man. <laughs> Jeez, now I'm all depressed. Thanks a lot. Can't you just leave me alone now? What was your name again, Cannonball Head? Look, I told you not to call me that. My name's Meat Hook. And you still have a little attitude problem. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to call you Cannonball Head. That's okay. I'd rather have a Cannonball Head than a ponytail. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. Hey, you've got a pretty good sense of humor. Ha, want to see something really funny? Oh, I do. Picture of your whole bump family. Yes, please show me, Mr. Meat. Mr. Meat. Haha, watch this. Say hello, Roger. Hello, Roger. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha Pretty good, eh? I got a whole routine, but I don't have the time to do it all right now. Maybe if we're ever on a long ocean voyage together. But until then, I'm a very busy man, so... Could you show me that neato tattoo thing again? <laughs> neato tattoo. Well, okay, but just one more time. Haha, <laughs> watch this. Say hello, Roger. Hello, Roger. 
Whoops, I just realized that this is the wrong house. Oh, okay. Have a nice time on Melee Island. Say goodbye, Roger. Goodbye, Roger! So what did that get me? That got me nothing. That got me absolutely nothing. That doesn't seem to work. Can I do anything else with this? I told you. I don't have the time to show you any more tattoo tricks. Whoops, I just realized that this is the wrong house. Oh, okay. Hmm. Have a nice time on Melee Island. Yeah, he'd probably be good for later. That's fine. It's just like the one on the other side. It's just like the one on the other side. So we still don't have a helmet, and we don't have something to wow. distract the dogs. Wow, both ways. That's some chicken. That's some chicken. Anywhere we haven't been yet. That's a fair question, maybe. I don't know if we can get there. Move out of the way or I cut my way through. Nice night we're having, isn't it? I sure hopes you had something more important to stop me for. Why do you guys talk so funny? Pirate lingo. It's how everybody talked back then. Come on, Guybrush, play along. <laughs> Sorry to bother you. I'll uh, be on my way. Maybe like a house or something we haven't been in yet. Alright. Well, BRB. Somewhere we haven't been yet. I wonder if I can go back that way.
Ye old rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle shop. <laughs> Serving your rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle needs for over 50 years. <laughs> I'll just be running along now. I told you you could do something earlier. Lipsy well, said I could go jump in the lake. <laughs> I don't know if he took that that literally. I assume he just meant go away. in the middle. What possible use could that have? It might be something you can use as a helmet in town. So what can we use as a helmet? It's locked! It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. Something we could use as a helmet. What could we use as a helmet? I don't think there was anything in the church. Barrel, perhaps? I can't move it. Hmm. Scumbar kitchen for a helmet. All right. Well, we'll just do that then. <laughs> now, if I get lost, I'll just. Really, we gotta go to the Scumbar kitchen? But he won't let me into the kitchen. Brock! This is a back way in. Oh, I guess I just have to wait for the chef to leave. Hey! All right. Don't go into the kitchen. Yo, <laughs> oh, what a cheek. I just gotta wait for him to leave.
It's boiling hot. I think that bird will peck my hand off. I think that bird will peck my hand off. So kick the bird. I think that bird will peck my hand off. To beat him with something. God damn. It's a bird. It's a seagull, for God's sakes. Uh... Oh well. Something to use as a. Oh, as a helmet. We could use that pot as a helmet. I think it's full of that foul stuff pirates drink. Well, we got some meat. I assume we could use that for the dogs and a pot for our helmet. So that's progress, I think. I don't see anything special about it. I don't see anything special about it. It's some sort of meat or meat-like substance. Mmm, <laughs> stewed meat. I don't want to put that in. Now we've got stewed meat. Ow! Got it! I can't pick that up. I can't pick that up. No, don't. Let's just go. Alright, I think we're good now. got our helmet, so I want to go earn my all that pieces of eight. Then we'll come back and we can buy some stuff. We get our sword. We could get our map. So let's go to the circus first, I think. Weasel, Weevil, Miscreant, Tony, Ne'er do well. Can I borrow a trampoline? Hello again. <laughs> Ready to do the cannon trick? Have you got a helmet? Of course I have a helmet. What sort of idiot do you think you are? Well, let's have it. We want to be sure that it's a safe. Wouldn't want you hurt. No sorry. Ah, that will work as a helmet. <laughs> now we can do the trick. Step right over here, son. Now put on your helmet. And get in the cannon. And we'll take care of the rest. Echo! Echo! <laughs> oh, God! <laughs> it works! Oh, I'm so relieved. <laughs> are we dead? Hey! Are you okay? <laughs> Where's my... I'm... Bobbin are my... <laughs> Where's... Where's my helmet? <laughs> He's all right! Hooray! We are spared an embarrassing and a financially debilitating lawsuit. Here is your money, sir. Just a recompense for aiding us. The basic theory is fine. We just need to change the aim a bit. 
I'll try it next. No, I'll do it next. No, me. No, me. <laughs> now they're arguing over Smack who's up. going to go in. Loser. Ruffian. <laughs> fop. <laughs> How do they call him a fop? <laughs> we got monies. Now we can buy our map, buy our sword, and buy a shovel. Oh yeah! Excuse me, but do now oh, it's only you again. Come back for the map to the legendary lost treasure of Melee Island, huh? I hope you brought enough money this time. I'll take it. It'll make a swell gift. There you go. You made a wise decision. Now get lost. I wasn't sure how often the game auto saves, or even sure it was auto saving. So, just wanted to make sure. Hey, where'd you go? I hike halfway across the island to try and get you a reservation with the Swordmaster, who, by the way, says you can go jump in the lake. And when I come back, whew, you're gone. See if I ever do you a favor again. Can I help you? What do you want? About this sword. Yeah, what about it? I want it. Great. <laughs> Best hundred pieces of eight you ever spent. What else do you want? About this shovel. Yeah, what about it? I want it. I want it. Great. Oh, it'll pay for itself, believe me. Yeah, you'll dig up 75 pieces of eight in no time. But hey, save some treasure for the rest of us, would you? <laughs> what else do you want? I'd like some rat repellent, please. Ha! I bet you would. But I haven't got any. What else do you want? No rat repellent, eh? I think I'd just like to browse. Oh, be my guest, oh, fancy sure. pants. <laughs> Alright, we got a sword. And a shovel. And meat. Let's go see if we can deal with these dogs now. The deadly piranha poodles. I'm not going near them. I'm not going near them. Damn. Well, who's clubbing with a shovel? Big master. The only shovel for serious <laughs> treasure hunting enthusiasts. Well, that meat did nothing. Not near them. Hmm. I had something to give to the troll. Yes, I know. Do I have anything I can give to the troll? 
could possibly give him a shovel. We have a sword and a shovel now. Uh, the meat temporarily distracted the dogs. I didn't know if I was supposed to move as soon. There will be another meat in the kitchen now. Hmm. Give it a bit more thorough of a look. Fair enough. mind you guys suggesting which way I go. I'm not that worried about it. Like, the fun of this game isn't figuring out what thing I need to click on. The fun of this game is the dialogue and the jokes and so anything that moves us along that path at a good pace, I'm totally cool with. You telling me what to click on doesn't really detract from this game, I feel, so don't sweat it too hard. I'm not going to sit here and chastise you. Don't you dare tell me what to click on. I will click everything and find the thing to click. Yeah, exactly. Some sort of meat or meat like substance. It doesn't seem to open. We beat this. <laughs> I think that bird will peck my hand yeah, off. Yeah, beat it with a shovel. Master, the only shovel for serious treasure hunting enthusiasts. <laughs> we make meat chicken. Or mint ch mint meat. <laughs> make minty meat. I think I've been had. This is no map. It looks like... Dancing lessons. <laughs> back two, three, four, left two, three, four, right two, three, four, left, right, back, left. Cha, cha, cha. Do the monkey. <laughs> Is that the Pillsbury Doughboy? Is this the lake we can just jump into, maybe? Oh! <laughs> I don't know how I was supposed to know to do that. Got fish. Fishy, 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 fishy. So we've got we got fish. Maybe the troll wants fish. Hmm. 
Hunk of meat. Right. Well, I can't move it. I don't know if I need to stew the meat anymore, but... I can't move it. It's some sort of meat, or meat-like substance. I don't think it needs meat and fish. Ow! Got it! We got stewed fish. Hmm. I don't know if there's any real point to that. We have fish. Maybe the troll wants fish? Mm -hmm. Well, we have a bunch of stuff now. We can go see what the troll's about. Maybe he wants a shovel? Mm -hmm. I guess we'll go say hi to the troll. See if we can get past him with anything in our inventory. Or he'll eat us. You know, whatever. Let's see what he wants. Do you ever wonder if we're all just characters in a novel? Do you ever wonder if we're all just characters in a novel? Yikes! Oh, you almost scared me to death! I thought you were a... Oh, never mind. I was on hey, What did you say your name was again? Holy <laughs> Squinky. Squinky. <laughs> okay, Squinky. Uh, I'm over this way? Huh? Oh. <laughs> Who are you? I'm the lookout of Melee Island. I watch the ocean for approaching storms and ships, and report them directly to the governor. She doesn't like unexpected visitors, especially not now. Why is the governor worried about unexpected visitors? Actually, it's the expected visitors we're worried about. One pirate captain in particular. A dead one, but that doesn't make him any less dangerous. How did you get to be the lookout when you're obviously blind as a bat? Watch your tongue. <laughs> I was handpicked by Sheriff Shinetop. I'll just be off to seek my fortune now. Good luck. Hmm. Handpicked by Sheriff Shinetop, eh? It's a blind man to be the lookout. Ah, oh, a red herring. Pass. Huh. Awesome. <laughs> Where the hell is this guy? Did he just get... <laughs> Jedi forces way put that club back into his hand. Stan's previously owned vessels. Oh man. <laughs> it's a grog machine. Welcome to Stan's previously owned vessels. I'm off searching the globe right now for the finest <laughs> in previously owned marine transportation. Have a look around. I'll nice be right pun, back. the red herring. Stan. Biffy. Cute, but small. I don't see anything special about it. Huh. Nothing. Rob. Quick, beat it with a shovel. I can't move it. Dull, dull, dull. Ooh, look at a Viking ship. Ah, a fixer upper. Looks like one of those well engineered imports. 
I'm surprised this one is still afloat. <laughs> now that's a nice looking vessel. Now that's a nice looking vessel. Indeed it is. Can we just I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take it. I can't pick that up. Yeah. Welcome to Stan's previously owned vessels. I'm off searching the globe right now for the finest in previously owned marine transportation. Have a look around. I'll be right back. Be right back. Stan. He's just traveling the world, you know. I'd better not. Hmm. Ah, this is your sword master. Captain Smirk's big body pirate gym. Oh, sword trainer. Prices. Sword training, 30 pieces of weight. Cannon firing, 160 pieces of weight. Balls extra. Grappling hook. 130 pieces of weight. Hook extra. Well, I think I'll knock. It'd only be polite. What do you want, you wimpy little spineless maggot? <laughs> Could you train me to be better than the Swordmaster? Better than the Swordmaster? You? <laughs> you could never be half the sword fighter Carly is. Even with hours of hard work and sweat and blood. I remember fighting side by side with Carla at Port Royal. The local constabulary had us cornered. It looked like we were done for, but then she said... But I digress. You just don't have what it takes. I do so have what it takes. You do not. I do so. You do not. <laughs> I do so. No, I like your spirit. I'll do what I can. <laughs> I like your of spirit. Of course. It'll cost you. What do you got? I have stitch. Well, I've got 30 pieces of eight. Say no more, say no more. Let's see your sword. Okay, check it out. Yes, this is a nice one. Let's get to it. Okay, you maggot. Why don't you whip that sword out and let's see what you can do with it. <laughs> Boy. You fight like Boy. a dairy farmer. <laughs> I usually don't waste my time with vermin. Hey, now, my in-laws are dairy but farmers. Seeing as this LeChuck thing has put a cramp on business, I got no choice. I need the money. Yes, I can see this is going to take some... We're top 10 favorite games of all time. Awesome. Just want you to know, I don't do this with everyone. It's only because I feel that special... Student mentor pieces of eight bonding that I'm going to these lengths. I'm gonna put you up against the machine. The machine? Is this gonna hurt? <laughs> Yikes. Oh gosh. Come at me. Don't be afraid, you won't hurt me. No! Beat first, then lunge! Use your forte against the foible! No! Beat first, then lunge. Watch your footwork. Use your forte against the foible. Hours later. <laughs> You're starting to get the hang of it. Ten hours later. More hours later. <laughs> Not bad. You've got good form. Now I'm going to let you in on the true secret of sword fighting. Sword fighting is kind of like making love. It's not always what you do, but what you say. Any fool pirate can swing a sharp piece of metal around and hope to cut something. But the pros, they know just when to cut their opponent with an insult. One that catches them off guard. You see, kid, 
Your wits Remember, when making love, so always use a well-timed insult for full effect. Let's try out, shall we? Okay. Imagine this. We're fighting up a storm. Just like Carla and I were doing at Port Royal. <laughs> There's a sudden break in the fighting, and I say to you... You fight like a dairy farmer! <laughs> you respond with... <laughs> so is your mother. I'm over here at glue. <laughs> you must be thinking of someone else. I am not a farmer. I can see we've got a lot of work to do here. <laughs> I mean, none you of those options were particularly with good. Like, how appropriate. You fight like a cow. You see, it's razor sharp wit like that that wins fights. Let's try another. <laughs> Imagine this. You're trapped up against a wall. My sword just slashed two cuts into your face. I say, soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. You respond with? Soldier. <laughs> appropriate, How you fight like a cow. You fight like a cow. <laughs> no, no, no. That was the response from the last insult. Doesn't even make sense when used here. Ah, oh. <laughs> a correct response to "soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab" would have been something like: first, you better stop waving it around like a feather duster." See, <laughs> razor sharp. Now, I suggest you go out there and learn some insults. I can't help but feel like I've been ripped off. I'm sure you're feeling something similar. <laughs> the little fourth wall break there. <laughs> hmm. Learning some insults. Well, those guys at the circus seem quite good at uh, verbally bashing each other. So maybe we'll go talk to them. Those crazy spaghetti brothers are still in there. Yes, they Those are. Those crazy spaghetti brothers are still in there. I think there's something going on in there. Those crazy spaghetti brothers are still in there. I think there's something going on in there. Those crazy spaghetti brothers are still in there. My, what an unusually bright yellow they are. I know it's illegal, but... My, what an unusually bright yellow they are. Can we get it? Yeah, we got it. Ooh, a campsite, eh? Looks like an old abandoned campsite. That doesn't seem to work. Hmm, does not seem to work. What if we use our rubber chicken? I don't think strolling through the forest picking flowers is very good practice for being a pirate. Hey. Hey now, you don't know, you're not even a pirate, how would you know? Ah. I don't think strolling through the forest picking flowers is very good practice for being a pirate. Creepy. That doesn't seem to work.
<laughs> I can't pick that up. Just a regular old stump. Regular old stump. Back, left, right, left, right, back, right, left, back. Maybe this is how to get through here. Right, we gotta do the monkey, maybe. start from the beginning. Um, hold on. I can find a way out of here. Danger, open ravine. Ah. Don't come at me. I haven't played Fractured Butthole. I played the first one. We did do uh, Stick of Truth, which was an awesome game. so lost. <laughs> Nowhere to go.
game. Okay. Back here. Oh. Nice. Well, we come out. No. Oh, thank God. Jesus. All right. Hey, this better be important. My name is Guybrush Threewood. <laughs> Prepare to die. <laughs> you fight like a dairy farmer. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. <laughs> I'm shaking. I'm shaking. People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I give up. You win. Okay. Let's try this. Of course, there's two back paths. So let's try. Up. Left. Right. Left. Right. <clears throat> Up. Right. Left. Up. Aha. I dig. Oh, here we go. The legendary lost treasure of Melee Island. This carefully reproduced piece of Melee Island history has delighted thousands of would-be pirates and their families for generations. <laughs> Remember, there are other pirates on this island. So go easy on the treasure. Leave some for the next person. <laughs> This shouldn't take too long. Hours pass. <laughs> <laughs> Let's 
Hey, I think I hit something. Oh boy. Oh boy. It's a t-shirt. <laughs> Not my size, but a nice one nonetheless. A t-shirt. Well, I guess I should put all this dirt back now. More hours pass. <laughs> Here lies treasure of such unimaginable wealth. Well, you'll just have to dig it up to believe it. Paid for by the Melee Island Chamber of Commerce. I suppose it's just a quick way to leave. Yeah, oh well. Just follow our directions backwards, I guess. Oh, thank God. Aye. This better be important. Ever notice how all these roads start to look the same? Yeah, now that you mention it, they do. Ah, it's probably just that we're tired. <laughs> nice night we're having, isn't it? I sure hope you had something more important to stop me for. Sorry to bother you. I'll uh, be on my way. All right. All right, we'll go back in here. I found the treasure of Melee Island and all I got was this stupid t-shirt. <laughs> T-shirt. I guess we could go back and learn the other skills that we were supposed to. I believe you said uh, 163 pieces of eight. Could go learn, I think grappling hook was another one of the skills he could teach. Let me go back to teacher real quick. There's no answer. All right, never mind. try to meet again with the dogs things do seem time so I think as soon as we throw the meat we gotta try to get to the house maybe some of the pirates know some good insults Talk to us now that we know we've got the treasure. Well, if it isn't the boy who wants to be a pirate, how do you fare on your quest? I found your legendary lost treasure. Oh, I discovered the lost treasure, eh? You're a clever boy. You may keep the sheep. Do you have all the I won't throw the meat yet. Okay. Tell me again about mastering the sword. You must seek out and defeat the sword, Master. Someone in town can probably direct you. And get yourself trained first. I'll just be running along now. Leave us to our grog. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. The 
do have... Maybe we can go talk to that guy since we have the yellow flower. Maybe we can get ourselves arrested. Hold on. I told you. I don't have much more to say. I don't want anything but my freedom. I can't move it. I can't move it. Slash master, when you want a sword as sharp as your wit. It's some sort of meat or meat like substance. It's a striking yellow color. Yo, okay. Breath master, for the pirate who cares about first impressions. Breath master. I have 371 pieces of eight. Got my eye on you, boy. Steal anything and I break your legs. What do you want? I think I'd just like to browse. Oh, be my guest, <laughs> fancy pants. Hmm. Oh, it's a safe. All right, we'll head on out. Uh, we talk to Voodoo Lady again. Hey, I'm back and I'm ready to know more about the future. Guess no one's here. Thanks. Hmm. I'd rather not touch any of this creepy voodoo stuff. Well, let's see. There's a jar of bat drippings, a box that says assorted scales, a shaker full of monkey flakes, and some cat knuckles. Cat knuckles. Cat knuckles. <laughs> How barbaric. I mean, I approve. <laughs> Cat knuckles. You should poison that meat with something in your inventory. Uh. Uh. So maybe we'll go stew the meat. The flowers? I approve everything barbaric. Of course I do. What up, gal? It's 
not a bay leaf, but every cook makes substitutions. No! Oh, got it! Alright, well, hopefully that was poisonous? I don't know. Mansion. Hope this works with the meat. Yep. Yep. I guess we're just gonna murder her dogs. <laughs> Freaking piranha poodles. It'll just it'll just make them sleep. It definitely will not, you know, rot their insides. Important notice. These dogs are not dead. They are only sleeping. No animals were harmed during the production of this game. <laughs> See, I told you they're just sleeping. Looks like a job for Fester Shine Top. Oh shit. <laughs> Hypnotized squirrel some rhinoceros. What? The red button. <laughs> Big, ugly, hairy yak wearing some wax lips. <laughs> Push tremendous, dangerous looking yak. <laughs> I can't move it. Pick up staple remover. Walk to use staple remover on tremendous dangerous looking yak. <laughs> I'll need this. I must be nuts. <laughs> He's going back in. Pick up wax lips. <laughs> Pick up gopher repellent. Use. Use gopher repellent with gopher. <laughs> what funny little man. <laughs> Look at Barry's idol. It's beautiful. Oh my god. <laughs> that should hold him for a while. If only I had a file, I could get the idol. If only I had a file.
No time for reading now. Oh my god, we got all this stuff. Staple reviewer, box style, wax lips, go for repellent. Maybe go for repellent and also work on rats. I don't see anything special about it. All right, well, we need a file. We'll be back. Well, maybe we could use the gopher repellent in the prison to get rid of the rats. my work on the rats thanks here's the cake i'll bet there's a file in the cake it's heavy there it is all this time he had a file to escape but he wouldn't check the carrot cake uh. <laughs> I locked the sheriff in there. Yo, Ryu! Coming in with that mighty raid. How you doing, Ryu? I'm guessing your barbarian run didn't end well because I think it's still early. Let him out. Let him out. Hmm, this door appears to be locked. How did you die? <laughs> Shower came back. How did you die? What's up, everybody? We are playing Secret of Monkey Island today. Insta ripped. Damn. No time for reading now. So where is this idol? He walked outside the elders and insta died to a pack of archer skellies. Damn. Where is this idol? I've never played the Secret Monkey Island game, so this is my first time through. I don't see anything special about it. Where is the idol? Ah! Hmm. Oh, this door appears to be locked. Yo, Project Lambda. Actually, that's Zero Jin. Thank you for that follow. You're now Zero Jin the Barbarian. Where the hell is this idol we're supposed to get? So it's in a display case, which what to barbarian. and Project Lambda. Thank you for that part. Project Lambda, the barbarian. Yes, we're definitely aware of the uh, the old graphics, which is pretty awesome. <laughs> Walk to, walk to, open. And we're supposed to steal something out of here. No time for reading now. I think it's some kind of religious text. <laughs> I can't move it. Fall of Babylon. Thank you for the following on Fall of Babylon the Barbarian. Where is... Look at... They're yak-sized and covered with slobber. <laughs> I'm certainly not going to chew on them. <laughs> hmm. 
This is on Steam. Look at... <laughs> Love the old graphic look. Can we just walk that way? Get back in there and get the idol. Walk to the big hole in the wall. Okay. I've got the file. Going back in. <laughs> Yo, this a raptor. Hello. Manual style with shredder. Walk to give stylish confetti to heavily armed clown. <laughs> oh, high spirits is here. I didn't even know. <laughs> Throw wax lips into fire. Use file on rhinoceros toenail. Hmm. Pick up fabulous idol. <laughs> oh god. That was a close one. At least I got the idol. But I'm not done uh -oh. with you yet. Uh-oh. Thought you could get out of here with the idol of many hands, did you? Look, I can explain. So can I. Oh, shit. You poisoned the governor's pet poodles. <laughs> they're yeah. just sleeping. Yeah, they're, just, they're fine. They're fine. They're not dead. Broke into her house. The door was unlocked. <laughs> And stole one of her most valuable pieces of art. No, you've got it all wrong. Oh, really? Well, let's hear your explanation. It belongs in a museum. <laughs> it belongs in a museum. <laughs> What's going on here? I caught this hoodlum making off with your idol, Governor. He says it belongs in a museum. That's right, it does. What? There, yeah, see? You heard me, Fester. The real question is, how did he get in here while you were on guard? I, uh... <laughs> oh, just go away, Fester. I can handle this. Hmm. I'll deal with you later. <laughs> Sorry about him. He's new. I'm Governor Marley. <laughs> Governor Elaine Marley. Oh. So my idol belongs in a museum, eh? Indiana Jones Adventure games were also really fun. Gosh. Gosh. Relax, Mr. Threepwood. I know why you're here. Oh, do you? Believe me, you're not the first who's tried. Although I have to admit, not many get as far as you have. Jeepers. Jeepers. <laughs> My lookout told me of your arrival. <laughs> I wanted to meet you ever since. Lookout, you can't see shit. Name. Tell me, Guybrush, why do you want to be a pirate? You don't look like one. <laughs> your face is too sweet. Thanks. Heard you heard it, I see. Well. You're obviously not in the mood for idle chit-chat, are you? I said hurrah. I suppose you've got many more exciting things to do? I won't take up any more of your time, Mr. Threepwood. I really wish I knew how to talk to women. Oh, good stuff. Oh, where do you think you're going, Froom Wade? That's not too late for us to make a very excuse me, Mr. Shire Top, but you're blocking the doorway. Bus off, Buzz off Fester. I think you need to cool off. Hand over your sword. Uh oh. 
This is the end of the road, my little pantalooned oh. pal. Your troublemaking days on Melee Island are over. My plans for the governor are far too important and much too near completion to risk letting a would-be pirate like you get in the way. So long, Mr. Spice Cake or Droop Face or whatever your name is. <laughs> Damn. Hmm. This might actually turn out to be a pretty good day. <laughs> I can't reach that from here. Maybe we can... Quick! Use the staple remover! No staples to be removed! Damn it. I can't reach that from here. Sharp and dangerous. I can't reach that from here. Um... Actually, it's more like a fabulous doorstop. <laughs> I will admit, I think we'll spoil this, please, yeah. Oh, there's an axe! I see, walk to the axe. Heavy and sharp. <laughs> I guess I'll be needing a sword. This one will do. No, no, no. Axe. Get the axe. Get the axe. Get the, get, get the well, axe. That wasn't so hard. Oh. Now all I have to do is show this stupid idol to the pirate leaders and... You're alive! <laughs> Governor! <laughs> hey, you can talk. Huh, who'd have known? What are you doing here? Come to finish the job? No, I came down here to save your life. Fester wasn't acting on my orders when he threw you in there. Uh, you came down here. That to was one screen me? I could die in, but I have to wait well, ten I minutes. Didn't even think you liked me. <laughs> well, our first meeting was a little awkward. You seemed to have trouble forming complete sentences. I said things I couldn't do. Then again, so do most of my citizens. But I'm not one of your citizens. I'm just a drifter. <laughs> I'm nobody. <laughs> No life, no skill, thanks to Apollo. You're now no life, no skill, the barbarian. You'd let me drown. I would have Guybrush. Oh. Oh, Governor. <laughs> oh, Threepwood. <laughs> oh, Elaine. <laughs> oh, Guybrush. Oh, Guybrush. Love Muffin. Love Muffin. <laughs> Sugar Boots. <laughs> Honey Pumpkin. <laughs> Plunder Bunny. Plunder Bunny? Kiss me. What? No, we mustn't. What? Not here, where everyone can see us. Everyone? Why, are you ashamed of me? <laughs> yes. No, no, it's not that at all. It's Wonderful. just that many of these pirates have made advances towards me. And to avoid hurting their feelings, I've always told them that my father made me promise never to fall in love with a pirate. Oh. If they see us together, they'll know I was lying. Okay, then. <laughs> Let's go to your place. Shadows okay. can, thanks for the follow. You know, Shadows can the barbarian. Your first. I don't want you to be preoccupied. Oh. But. Hey, I can multitask. I feel this sudden urge to complete the trials quickly. Alyssa <laughs> 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 Raptor, thank you for that follow. Yeah, Alyssa Raptor, the barbarian. Where are we? Yeah. So all we have to do left is train up our swordsmanship. Sneakiest footpad in these aisles. Ah, the idol of many hands. Here a brave lad. Was a barbarian more of an abroad term? A yeah, barbarian could be female or male. Could be any race, any gender. Barbarian is all encompassing. Oh, 
I'll just be running along now. But if you prefer Barbarian S, so you can call yourself whatever you Come please. Come back later and tell us how you're doing. Barbarian. <laughs> there you go. Or Barbariana, indeed. So now we just gotta get good with the sword. <laughs> that was such a good movie. And if you ever get lost, you just have to summon Thor and talk to him. <laughs> Your good old buddy. <laughs> Triceracop. <laughs> Listen, I'm sort of busy right now. I'll talk to you later. Alright, let's go talk to teacher. Now we just have the master of the sword. There's no answer. <laughs> Maybe we have to actually win a fight. Guybrush Threepwood. My name Prepare is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. <clears throat> <laughs> there are no words for how disgusting you are. Oh, I'm shaken. Oh, I'm shaken. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. Oh, I'm shaken. Oh, I'm shaken. <laughs> you call yourself a pirate? Ah, is that the best you can come up with? You fight like a dairy farmer. <laughs> How appropriate. You fight like a cow. Oh, gotcha. I give up. You win. Let's just fight a couple of these guys and get what more insults. Wood, you scurvy lover. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare Hurrah. to die. <laughs> People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Even before they smell your breath? <laughs> I'm not gonna take your insolence sitting down. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? <laughs> <laughs> Even before they smell your breath? <laughs> Look behind you! A three-headed monkey! <laughs> Move out of the way! Or I cut me way through! My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to Prepare die! Prepare to die! Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? I am rubber. You are glue. I 
I'm not gonna take your insolence sitting down. Your hemorrhoids are flaring up again, eh? <laughs> People fall at my feet when they see me coming. Even before they smell your breath? Dun, 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 dun. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. I am rubber, you are glue. <laughs> I give up, you win. This guy. Whatever you want, you scurvy. Yo, God PW1, thank you for that follow. Oh, God PW1, the barbarian. Prepare My to name die. Name is Threepwood. Prepare to die. Dink, 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 dong. There are no words for how disgusting you are. Yes, there are. You just never learned them. You have the manners of a beggar. First, you'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> oh, yeah? <laughs> Get wrecked. Uncle! Uncle! What should be wanted, you scurvy lover? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to it's die. It's a bit of a process trying to learn all the insults. My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. So, you got that job as janitor, after all. <laughs> You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. Yes, there are. You just never learned them. <laughs> there are no words for how disgusting you are. Yes, there are. Oh, you just man. never learned them. Yo, Devovod, thank you for following. Yo, Devovod the Barbarian. So many barbarians. Soon you'll be wearing my sword like a shish kebab. First, he'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. Oh. Look behind you, a three-headed monkey! Stopping a bar, it can be dangerous to your health. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Have you stopped wearing diapers yet? Why? Did you want to borrow one? <laughs> My handkerchief will wipe up your blood. So you got that job as a janitor after all. <laughs> you have the manners of a beggar. I am rubber, you are glue! You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. I'd be in real trouble if you ever used them. <laughs> I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. Your hemorrhoids are flaring up again, eh? <laughs> All right. Look behind you, a three-headed monkey. All right. So you have to learn the uh, 
the question and the reply kind of separately. You want, you lover? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Do, 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 do. I got this scar on my face during a mighty struggle. I hope now you've learned to stop picking your nose. <laughs> I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. You have the manners of a beggar. I don't think I ever learned that reply. Why? Did you want to borrow one? I give up! You win! <laughs> what should be wanting, you scurvy lover? My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Prepare to die. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. He must have taught you everything you know. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Yo, what up, Gooby? There are no words for how disgusting you are. <laughs> yes, there are. You just never learned them. Do, 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 do. You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. Oh, I am rubber. You are glue. You fight like a dairy farmer. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. Oh. Yikes, nice move. Oh, you can fight on Game List. <laughs> I guess we can go see Teacher now. Maybe we've learned enough. Let's do one more. Dude. Stopping a bar, it can be dangerous to your health. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. Oh, yeah? You're no match for my brains, you poor fool. <clears throat> Might be in real trouble if you ever used them. This is the end for you, you gutter crawling cur. Even before they smell your breath? <laughs> I've heard you were a contemptible snake. Oh, yeah? 
<laughs> oh, yeah? Uncle! Uncle! Alright, one more. We'll see if we can get some replies to those. Those were good. Yeah, no Hotofu. I'm not- I'm- the game is literally cancer. Stopping a pirate can be I have a very short list of banned hands. games that's pretty much mostly Five Nights at Freddy's. My name is I Stupor. absolutely refuse Prepare to play to those die. games. This is the end for you, you gutter crawling cur. And I've got a little tip for you. Get the point. You have the manners of a beggar. Yes, there are. You just never learned them. There are no words for how disgusting you are. <laughs> yes, there are. You just never learned oh. them. <laughs> I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. He must have taught you everything you know. Look behind you! A three-headed monkey! A three-headed monkey? Alright, one more. Move out of the way, or I cut my way through. My name is Guybrush Threepwood. Prepare to die. <laughs> I've heard you were a contemptible sneak. Too bad no one's ever heard of you at all. I once owned a dog that was smarter than you. He must have taught you everything you know. Do, 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 do. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever will. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah? <laughs> This is the end for you, you gutter crawling cur. And I've got a little tip for you. Get the point? There are no words for how disgusting you are. Yes, there are. You just never learned them. Oh. Wow. You're good enough to fight the Swordmaster. All right, we're good enough. Let's go see our teacher. I like that it actually informs you when you're good enough. There's no answer. Alright, I guess we just go find the Swordmaster now. Which I think is the, um, the governess. insults to beat the sword master. Well, 
Well, someone in town, which is the shopkeeper. What's well, this guy? Excuse me, but do. Oh, it's only you again. I told you there was only one in existence. Now get lost. I'm not gonna warn you again. <laughs> Leave the rat alone! I'll just be running along now. Well, maybe we get our fortune told. Maybe she knows where to find the sword master. Hey! I'm back and I'm ready to know more about the future. Guess no one's here. Or not. Ah. We still have a staple remover. I've got my eye on you, boy. Steal anything and I break your legs. What do you want? I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. Look, I told you she doesn't want to see you. Maybe if you asked her again? Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there again. Be right back. Maybe we could follow him? And don't touch anything! <laughs> don't mind the fact that I just walked into plain sight of you. No, don't worry, don't even worry about that. I better just stay back here and eavesdrop. Hello again, Carla. I thought I told you to get lost. Actually, I'm here on uh, business. This kid, come into my store, see? Face it, you crusty old lech. You'd make any excuse just to come out here and bother me. Yeah, I guess so. Mm. Well, cut it out. I'm sick of it. Take a hike and don't come out here again. Someone might follow you, and then I'd become another Melee Island tourist attraction. Hey, it's your loss, baby. Yeah, right. <laughs> now scram. Twenty two percent, not bad. Right. 
How dare you approach the Swordmaster without permission? Oh, I dare. Which I surely didn't give you. Absolutely, this fine leather jackets. I beg your pardon. I must talk to you. I doubt that. Everyone who Yo, comes Master here is Yonda prepared Yonda to, to follow fight. your now Master Let's Yonda, be honest. the barbarian. You're here to prove yourself to the pirate leaders in hopes of one day being as immoral as they are. Yep, nailed it right on the head. Gee, you're smart. I can tell by the sarcastic expression on your face that you've been <laughs> fully trained by Captain Smirk. Let's get this over with. No one will ever catch me fighting as badly as you do. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. Only once have I met such a coward. Oh boy. <laughs> You're well, legacy. Even before they smell your breath? <laughs> now I know what filth and stupidity really are. I hope now you've learned to stop picking your nose. I will milk every drop of blood from your body. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. Every word you say to me is stupid. And I've got a little tip for you. Get the point? <laughs> My sword is famous all over the Caribbean. And I've got a little tip for you. Get the point? There. I give up. You win. I hope this teaches you a lesson. Now scram. No, 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 we fight again. We fight again. <laughs> How dare you approach the Swordmaster without permission, which I surely didn't give you. I, I beg your pardon. I must talk to you. I doubt that. Everyone who comes here is prepared to fight. Let's be honest. You're here to prove yourself to the pirate leaders in hopes of one day being as immoral as they are. Yep. Yep. Nailed it right on the head. Gee, you're smart. I can tell by the sarcastic expression on your face that you've been fully trained by Captain Smirk. Let's get this over with. My tongue is sharper than any sword. First, you'd better stop waving it like a feather duster. Ooh. Now I know what filth and stupidity really are. So you got that job as a janitor after all. I will milk every drop of blood from your body. How appropriate. You fight like a cow. You are a pain in the backside, sir.
Your hemorrhoids are flaring up again, huh? My wisest enemies run away at the first sight of me. Even before they smell your breath? Oh, we got her on the ropes. My sword is famous all over the Caribbean. And I've got a little tip for you. Get the point. My last fight ended with my hands covered with blood. I hope now you've learned to stop picking your nose. I give up. You win. Well, I hope you're happy. You can go back and brag to all your friends about how you beat the Swordmaster. You'll need proof. Here. This should convince them. What'd we get? Bad noise over here. I was wondering if that was the one. Awesome. But we've officially done it. We've completed the three trials. Alright. I think I'm going to have to call it there for now. I think we'll... Oh. Oh shit. Uh oh. <laughs> what was that? I'm so confused. Hey! What are you doing just Maybe standing I... oh, around? Shit. The governor's been kidnapped! What? By whom? LeChuck's got her on that ship that just sailed off. <laughs> I'm afraid we've seen the last of her. Oh no. I'll go get a crew in a ship and go rescue her. That's not gonna be easy, you know. LeChuck's taken the governor back to his hideout on Monkey Island. I'm afraid that no pirate on this island is brave enough to follow him there. But hey, good luck. Hey, <laughs> good luck. Oh, yeah, I almost forgot. Uh, they left this note. Left you note. can have it, but I don't think you'll like what it says. Attention, pirates of melee. Your governor is alive and well and by my side as she was always meant to be. If you try to find us, you will only meet with horrifying disaster. Uh oh. Yours truly, Captain LeChuck. No. All right. Seriously, though. That's going to do it for me for this evening, guys. Uh, I might be, well, for now, I might be back later this evening, and hopefully we can continue on with this awesome, hilarious.